Katie Price's ex-husband is fuming after Channel 4 failed to get his permission for their children to be shown in the Mucky Mansion show. Karen Haler, 34, accused producers of breaking their own strict rules for featuring under 16s on TV after Jet, 8, and Bunny, 7, were screened in Wednesday's first episode. Haler's spokesman said, Mr. Haler did not receive any communication from Channel 4 seeking his consent to sign off the children's appearance before the airing of this week's program. One would expect protocol to be adhered to especially in light of children being filmed without consent of both parties involved, as per Channel 4's own guidelines. C4's rules say ideally both parents' consents should be sought before filming kids. But the station only got Katie's blessing that it claims is enough. A spokeswoman for Channel 4 said, The production company obtained the appropriate permissions for all minors in the series. In the opening episode, which shows Katie, 43, renovating her West Sussex home, Bunny and Jet are seen doing arts and craft with the Mama Five. As the trio customize a mirror, Bunny says, Mum, did you know, it's not about spending money. It's about what you can make. Katie's daughter Princess, 14, with first husband Peter Andre, also features in the series. His agent did not respond to queries as to whether he had been consulted. A source said, Kieran was very unhappy the children are featured and paraded around on screen without his consent. It's unacceptable. This three-part series follows Katie and her family over seven months as they renovate her mansion after it fell into disarray and was hit by vandals. She also opens up on the show about her mental health woes, hitting rock bottom and getting help. Katie says, This house damaged my head, damaged me. I've had a journey from hell. I could not even walk through the front door, it would give me anxiety like you wouldn't believe. She reveals she initially enjoyed living at the house with her children and animals including horses and chickens. But that changed following her divorce to Kieran. Katie reveals, while all that was going on my marriage fell, for all reasons. The friends betrayed me. We've had two dogs that have died here, a horse that has died here. I've even had kidnap threats here. Just a lot of horrible, horrible stuff here. I can't tell you how much I hated this house. I just could not live here. Even driving up the driveway, I'd be like, oh, my god, oh, my god, because. I would just look at the mess.
Last weekend it emerged Katie could face jail if she is found to have breached a restraining order banning her from contacting Kieran's fiancé. She was arrested at her home in Horsham last Friday over the order. Karen is set to be quizzed by police over claims he assaulted an underage girl in 2016, which he vehemently denies. He has not been arrested.